The Joe Rogan Experience. Train by day, Joe Rogan podcast by night, all day. Hello, aliens and extraterrestrials. We are back at JRE Review. We are reviewing Jim Brewer today on the JRE Review. He is a stand-up comedian, actor, and you've probably seen him many times on here. He's one of Joe's good friends. All right, so we have an assortment of videos. I hope you watch them all, but anyways, have a great day. Bye, guys. They put Dylan Mulvaney on a Bud Light can. <laughs> That's what it is. These are dorks. And you see the response that Bud had, the most recent response? It's it's like the fucking dumbest pro America raw 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 like we don't know who you really are now There's like interviews with the lady who is the the head of Bud Light talking about why they did it and about the old Sort of frat culture attached to Bud Light dismissing so, The people and like the humor of the people that like Bud Light and so they're gonna change that with with this crazy attention whore <laughs> <laughs> on day 365 of being a woman. I mean, we are in a what? fucking Coen Brothers movie. This what? is a Mike Judge movie. You're a thousand percent correct. Like, yeah. how does no? How does nobody else see what what lunacy is going it's on right now? There's lunacy. no other way to explain it, bro. You got to watch this Bud Light commercial. This new Bud Light commercial. Find the new it's Bud just, Light commercial. It's this fun. is like it's the, the dumbest <laughs> pro America rah rah. It's so stupid and cliche. It fucking it hurts my feelings. It's so dumb. Listen to this. <laughs> this is a company in deep shit, bro. <laughs> and they make things like this. Look, you got the prairies, the ocean, you got a Clydesdale running down the tell street. You a story. Oh. About a beer. <laughs> rooted in the heart of America. Found in a community where a handshake is a sure contract. <laughs> what the fuck are you Rude talking about? Those who found opportunity <laughs> and challenge. You know, I would respect I know them what this is. if they had this, and then Dylan Mulvaney just starts Raised cartwheeling into the frame. <laughs> Day 368 of womanhood! This is when some CEO is like, who's, yeah. who's, who is in charge? Ah, oh, he's yeah. 90 years old. Get him! And he comes, well, this is how right. we used to do this it. You need story. the goddamn Clydesdales, first of all. Look at this. <laughs> is the story of the American spirit. Oh, Shut the God. fuck up. Wow. Shut the fuck up. Holy now shit. I hate you more. <laughs> 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 like, what are you, you doing? You, what is that? What was that? You can't, you can't come Bro. out in, in, like, chick's clothes and then turn around and bring a stallion out. Well, the like, problem I is... What I saw. If you let CEOs talk about stuff like that and give their opinions about stuff like that, then everybody knows who you are. So you can't just make this commercial. Like, where's this coming from? Right. Was this AI generated? That's probably a chat GPT 4.0 version of the perfect American commercial. <laughs> That's really what it is. That shit didn't have nothing to do with drinking Bud Light either, by the way. That was like, that made me want to move to Montana. Like, you want to be in the mountains and see the dust and shit. <laughs> but that, That's like the what? dumbest commercial of all time. <laughs> but it's so obvious what they're doing. It, they're trying to like they needed to let that sit for a little bit. But that's what I'm saying. You don't have one or two guys on the board going, I don't know if this is a good decision, bro. I don't I don't think they get to. I think that lady made a decision and she thought inclusiveness is important and we're gonna open up like, the brand to new people. Or is this like a is this like <laughs> an organized crime hit? The thing is like if she didn't make the, the thing about frat boy culture if she didn't like kind of disparage, what was her exact quote? See if you can find her exact quote. <clears throat> she didn't disparage the 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 humor of the people that enjoy the product. Like that is such a crazy move. Well, that's what I'm saying. Is this like an organ in my head? I go wacky, but, but what I'm saying is like if she just said like everyone can like Bud Light, like if, if that was her and she's like America is the freedom to be whoever the what, fuck you want to be. What did you see? If that's what they said, I'd be like, okay, great. She she was um, disparaging. She, the, know, she was talking about inclusivity and talking about like the sort of frat culture around Bud Light. The CEO's name is Brendan Whitworth. It's, is that the guy? I don't know. That's there was a woman saying, yeah. So that's that's a man. So that this person was a woman. Unless I'm misgendering them, Jesus Christ, don't say it. Um, 
Uh, it was a woman for sure. There's videos of her talking about it. There's videos of her um, talking about why she made the decision to do this. But it's like, you can say that we want other people, like America's freedom, and you, the freedom to be whoever you want. If you want to be a woman for day 368, that's your freedom too. But if you're doing that and trying to like change who buys the company and dismiss all the other people who buy the company buy the the beer from the company that's so dumb that's like such a silly move well that's what I'm saying. it's so weird to me i instantly always see mob hits yeah not, not i see a mob hit just walking in like your company's done what do you mean fucking done what do you mean bang 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 everyone's fucking out Put on the uh, thing that's going to get rid of their crowd. You don't think you're fucked? You'll never kill us. Oh, really? Let's run it. Oh, you mean like someone did it to try to kill Bud Light? Dude, they're fucked. What think... a great hit. <laughs> that would be amazing if Heineken snuck in and did that to them. Someone came in there. <laughs> like, put the... Put the transitioning. <laughs> yeah, the, the lady who was a guy, like an agent provocateur. Earth, kill everybody. Yeah, you have an agent inside the company the that tanks the company, and it turns out you're shorting them on the stock market. They have crushed it, and you're yeah. buying shit on the side, and you open up a different company that's yeah. really manly. The Joe Rogan Experience. Train by day, Joe Rogan podcast by night, all day. <laughs> <laughs>